Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. Today we're going to just have a vlog to be honest. And I want to talk about a new game that I will play for YouTube and it's going to be fun. And I'll grind a lot, depends if it requires grinding, but something I figured out over the, the span of my channel and over the span of, of years, I'm a quitter. I truly am. Like there, there is a type, there is many types of gamers and one type is a quitter. I do make videos, like for example I, I made Ra Rise of Ragnarok videos, I did play that a long time after I stopped recording and it's, it was fun and then I forgot to log it yesterday and I was like okay that's fine I should log it today and then I'm not motivated anymore. I'm like sitting here like I, I CBA <laughs> and I am i don't know if that shows laziness or something or just I don't want to use my time on it because as feared as this sounds especially for being the channel I am, I don't feel much of a, like a super gamer. I don't know why. There's only two games that has kept me around and that has been Conqueror Online and it has been Age of Vengeance too, but all other games I've just quit. I've played them, I've quit. Like I played Rise of Ragnarok for a while, then I quit. I played Paradise Land for a while, then I quit. I played Blue and Sour Defense for a short while and I quit. I played Fortnite. I still want to make videos of it, but I feel like as YouTube goes right now, it's very oversaturated. There are like you can find millions of videos of that game right now. Like that's the hyped thing, and there's still a lot of hype of it. But I don't feel like for my channel there is much interest in it because people can just see it from a million YouTubers who's probably way better than I am and maybe even more entertaining. I don't. I doubt that. I'm the most entertaining in the world. Kidding. <laughs> uh, but but as you as you can see that that Fortnite video didn't do as well as I hoped for. I'm not like going out like, hey, I want views. I want yada yada yada. But I felt like after that video, like I'm a very new. I'm a very big amateur at that game, and there's millions and freaking billions of hours recorded on that game from a lot of people. And I feel like I probably wouldn't be the most interesting to watch, and um, I can't. Maybe that's displayed in the in the in the in the analytics of it, like it didn't do as well. It may also just be because if it's just a different game, like different games don't get a lot of views, which is what I'm going to talk about doing a new game, and hopefully it will do well. And if it doesn't, then it's fine. But I don't think I will quit it, like I've quit... What other games have I quit? I've quit... Whatever that mythic, mythic glory I've quit. I've quit Lineage 2 Revolution. I've quit... Ah, uh, Revelation Online. I wanna come back to that to be honest. It's out of beta now, it's like fully released and it's free. And I did love the time I played on it, I just had so many technical difficulties because it was the first time I was ever live streaming. <laughs> but yeah, I love it's beautiful, but then I just quit it. Because like, it's, a f it's fun while I'm playing it, and then the day after or whatever, I'm just not motivated, and motivated anymore. I'm like, well, I, I, see BA play I see BA recording this when they're playing it. So that's why I'm kind of like, I'm a quitter, that's what I am. I I'm a quitter, I'm I quit things. And it's a it's a bad habit, but at least I play many new games. I guess the this channel style for quitters would be to record different games like many times a week. Like I I don't see Markiplier, but I hear he does it. He plays many random games. Maybe is that something I should do too? But I would like to keep a ser. I like serious type of content, like I loved making 100 videos of the Let's Play series, I loved making like 26 others of the other Let's Play series, 7 Day Challenge series. And the Battle Royale, I count it as a series, even though I don't have numbers on and episode names, but it's just... Everything about League of Angels feels like a freaking series to me. <laughs> and uh, the same for League of Angels Paradise Land, I, I didn't quit. But I don't play it a lot. I don't. Pl I don't play it much. And then when I'm tr going to log on, I feel very hesitant for some reason. And it's very unfortunate that that is. That 
why am I, I I don't want to go on not feeling like I want to record it. It's like it's like doing something that you don't want to do, but you're doing it to please others. Like I'm I'm not a uh, I'm I'm not doing that. I I want to make what I want to make, and it sucks that I don't want to make a lot. <laughs> uh, so. Legion Avengers videos will obviously continue, decreased amount, I may do more random games. But now all of you have probably clicked off, but the game I'm going to start, hopefully my PC can run it, is named PixArc. Maybe even be in the thumbnail under the video title, because I, I know there's a lot of hype for that game and I would like to get on that train early on. I would like to grind on it, I would like to play on it, I would like to have fun on it. I want that to be my new League of Angels too. I want that, my channel to grow from League of Angels to Pixar and to new big upcoming games coming out. Which is like, it's like people like seeing it. I, I will, I'm going to watch some people play Pixar, like I myself am a viewer of games. And I think it's going to be a very fun game to record. So, <laughs> I'm just, I'm just very, very, very excited for Pixar, and it's going to be quite nice. I, I hope. I saw the trailer. I, I hope I'm not a quitter on that game. It's all I can say. But yeah, I suppose we'll see what happens. <laughs> I just wanted to make this short video, like, talking a little bit about what I, what I was thinking and. Admitting that I am a quitter, which you guys have probably already know. I'm a quitter of things Like even YouTube a, a way long time ago. I played it a while. I didn't get any any views or anything. I was like Shit, I, I like doing it for myself But then again, I was like why am I just talking to myself posting it on the internet like what kind of loser am I in a way and I was like yeah, I'm quitting so I have had many YouTube channels I've had I think two and or three. I think three, but I haven't... One of them I don't think I ever uploaded on or something, or I was going to start it but I never did because I quit before I started. Anyway, then I became a... Uh, yeah, um, Athena123 YouTube channel. Hey! And then I changed the name to Incredible John. And I'm very happy, very happy that I never quit on YouTube because it's been a very fun time and I... You guys are amazing for watching these videos. If you're watching till this, till this point, you're a really great person, to be honest. I'm very, I'm very thankful for you watching to this point. Anyway, <laughs> I'm saying anyway way too much. Anyway, 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 I will talk to you guys in my next video. Uh, I don't know what it will be. Will it be Legion of Angels 2? Will it be Legion of Angels Paralyzed Land? Will it be Rise of Ragnarok? Will it be Terra? Will it be... Yeah, also my Quitter on Terra, I guess. Uh, will it be Fortnite? Who knows? I don't even know what I'm going to record tomorrow, but we'll see. <laughs> I just wanted to get some stuff off my chest, I guess, and yeah, as for real life, segment. As for real life, I'm just having it quiet for my recording so I can see, so I can edit. Because I, I, I've lately on my YouTube videos, I've I kind of like editing, like cutting things and having comedic things, like that Neo thing from yesterday. Did you see it? Did you like it? Um, yeah. There. What was I going to talk? Oh uh, yeah, as for real life, <laughs> as for real life, I've gotten to work a lot more lately. Like, I worked Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, which is today, and I'm also going to work Thursday tomorrow. And then I'm going to a meeting thing on Friday, and I may, may, it's very uncertain, may move out uh, on May 1st. So I don't know if I'll make like a GoFundMe page. Hey, go, go, go. That would be kind of hilarious though. Should I do it just for the lols? I may, I may do it just, just for the lols. <laughs> like to, to sponsor like the, the rent. Like, uh, my rent is due, I have to pay it. Anyway, I may move out and that's a big step for my life because I've never lived by myself fully I've had experience with living ish alone like my dad has traveled for two or three weeks and I've been alone and made my own food and and whatnot So I kind of know how to do it But it will be different in a new entirely new location new uh, well 
like apartment, not new by all means, but it's it's an apartment I've seen at, looked at online, and uh, yeah, that should be interesting. I don't know how YouTube will. I, yeah, I, I will actually have an office there. It's not big, like it's it's uh, 60 square meters, and uh, it's it's quite small, but it has one bedroom. And one guest room, and that guest room will be my office for making YouTube videos. So that should be very fun. If, okay, this, again, I'm saying if. I may move out. May. I say may. Also, I moved out, but I moved with a friend, so I felt like that wasn't really moving out. Like, back way back when, for you guys who saw that. Um, but, yeah, if that works, then it should be great. Because then, I can bicycle to the airport where I could work. Because uh, they usually you need a license, but if I can just bicycle there, like I can tell them, hey, I can get here 3:30 a.m. no problem, because there I don't need to be, rely on bus. And another thing is I can bicycle to to my other reception, which I am at, not my reception, but the reception I'm at. And then, f like 400 meters, I can just go straight to a bus, bus, uh, bus, whatever, and I can just take that bus to wherever I want to. Uh, and the buses there go like every six minutes. Here I live right now, they go once an hour. So, convenience sake, that place is like, it's like I just moved down from hell to earth, basically. So, I, I'm not saying I'm living in hell. <laughs> Luciferia, where are you? <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's, it's going to be much, much better for me. Because I, okay, I will tell you guys something. I currently, for the past days, have woken up at 6, um, 6.45 a.m. I've taken the 7.15 bus a.m. I've uh, then taken uh, the bus to the city, and once I'm at the city at 7.59 a.m. I'm taking the train at 8.07 a.m. I am at my workplace at 8.17 a.m. And I have to wait all the way until 9 a.m. to start work. Then I'm working now till 4 p.m. And I have to take the train 4.07 p.m. to the city. And I wait in the city from 4.17 p.m. to 4.40 p.m. And then I'm home at around 5.10 p.m. So I'm almost away for what? 10 plus hours and I'm only working for 7 hours. There's just too much waiting and too much trouble and this is the main main reason why I want to move out if I lived anywhere close or anywhere convenient I would never move out well I would but like that's what's push that's what's pushing me to move out and that's why I'm very freaking very hopeful that I can do that but the, 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 the problem is money which is obviously a problem so yeah, um, yeah, that's just something I, I really would like to. Uh, for example, if I'm going to work at 7 a.m., I would like to wake up at 6:30 a.m. or something like that instead of having to take. I don't think I could get to the airport. There is no buses from here to get there to 7 a.m. So if I somehow got it I would have to take 5 15 a.m. so I would have to be up one and a half hour earlier than I normally would have if I lived close to that place so hopefully you guys can see my my problem on that yeah I've just rambled on I got kind of depressed over all the traveling I have to do <laughs> so I'm crossing my fingers to be able to move out but yeah I'm a, I'm a quitter on games I know and yeah have a good stay, and um, maybe I will do a GoFundMe page for the lols. Maybe maybe it'll blow up. That would be like, I I people mix miracles with something acts of God or religion, but I look at the miracle as something very unexpected to happen. So maybe a miracle will happen that something happens like that. I don't know. Maybe God does exist. I I I I'm not going to like. I'm magnetic. Agnetic, agnetic, atheist or whatever. I don't believe it until I see it, but when I see it, oh damn, I'm a believer. Anyway, okay, uh, that's about it. Have a good one and uh, goodbye.